Hi, this is Random Guy 818 bringing you another Transformers video review of Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Smokescreen. As you can see, it's a Pontiac Salt type, I guess. Yeah. He's um he's a repaint of Jazz, and um there's some uh, minor details added to him. But, yeah. Um, here's, um, the 2007 movie Jazz. Similar, but there's, like, different, you know, aesthetics in them. So, let me show you the diff um, the difference f between them. Um, so, yeah. As you can see, um, Jazz, he has a yellow, yellow-silverish fog light. When Jazz, um, I mean, sorry, smoke screens, is just a full, clear shiny sky blue I guess and same thing for his um headlights here let me just his headlights are like um like a sky blue light sky blue where Jazz's is just silver also his is like a his grill it's a dark gray when Jazz's was just a black and there's like it's different like the style is kind of different here he had like a black in his side in his side skirt. He had like a black uh, venting. Same thing for his um the side vendor of it. Here it's just like the same navy blue as the whole vehicle. Here just like the same red as his finnels. And he has like a silver stripe with um it's like a dark red with dark red finnel and here it's just thing and he has an Autobot symbol right there. So yeah, and uh, Jazz's wheels, it's black with a silver outline, when Smokescreen's is just a full black. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. I prefer both, they're nice figures, I mean nice cars. And there's some other things I'm going to show a lot of this transformation. And one more thing, um, Jazz's is a, like a clear dark blue tinting, where um, Smoke screens is just a full black, so you can't see anything through it. Just full black. Yeah. Now to get onto his transformation, you're just gonna want to separate his hood piece. Separate it just like. Oh, it's really in there. Oh, there you go. Pull it apart. Oh, his hands are coming out and getting in the way. That's what the problem was. There we go, that's what I want. Okay. See, and then I'll just pull the spo spoiler down and then lift it up like that. For now, I'll leave it like that to save some room in this transformation. So, yeah. And then separate his legs, pull them down, pull them out, and then he has like this joint which lets him move it around, you know, just. It's not a ball joint, but something different. I don't know what the name is for that. Then he's just going to pull out his feet, pull out his heel, and then um, he has sort of the same thing as Jazz. His, like, like the, um, it's, they didn't really change anything in his leg, so it's still kind of like, you can't move it all the way back because of the door. They didn't really change that. That's what I was meaning to say. And then you pull out the heel on the other leg, just like we did on the right left leg. Then just pull it out all the way. There we go. And Jazz's, Jazz's leg, he has like these red dots. I, I don't know, I think it's part of the taillight. I, I'm not really sure about that. But here, um, smoke screens just, there's nothing there. It's, it's It has the exact same hole, but there's no red dot. It's just plain navy blue like the, the rest of the car. And here he has vinyls, and you know, he's a repaint, so yeah. Didn't go on one. Oh, and Jazz, he had the Autobot symbol. I don't know if you could see it right there. Smoke screen doesn't it? Just clear dark gray. And then um, peg it in there. Bring this out and around. Bring this. Pull out his fingers. And one more thing about um, Jazz's. Oh, uh, I mean smoke screens. Hands. Um. Let's see, wait for a moment. 
jazz you could pull it out and see he has like three holes for it to move around. I don't know if you can see that. Let me zoom in. Where smoke screen is just a regular two holes. So I, I like smoke screens better because jazz it just gets confusing and like the, it starts coming off. But smoke screens is just full secure and you know you can just pull it out easily like that. There. That's how it's supposed to be. And you want to pull this around. Same on the other hand, and yeah, that, you 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 got everything here. All you want to do now is just pull this. Let me zoom out. Pull this like that, and then pull this down, and it brings out his head, and then it puts his front bumper into place. That's how you want it. Go back. <sighs> Why is it so... There we go. Sorry about that. And here he is in his robot mode. Stand him up. I don't have his gun. I don't have his gun with me. It's technically the same gun as um, Jazz's, but it's just dark navy blue, like the rest of his vehicle mode. put this like that and here's complete robot mode his face is, is almost like exactly the same except he still has the um clear um what's the name well he has a clear back uh, pa blue passing in the back so he could it's a lighting code there we go lighting code so it reflects light and then it closes his eyes blue it's technically the same thing as jazz has but yeah I don't have the gun with me sorry Here's a quick size comparison with 2007 movie Barricade. He's roughly bigger. He's the exact same size as Jazz, I'll give you that. Just same thing as Jazz except repaint. Yeah. Here he is, he's out. And I got him from Target. You can get him from Target, Toys R Us, anywhere. So he's in stores. That's him.